she has written down everything and she gives you the ideas which we had yesterday. Yeah. So it is so, uh, Wednesday, 12 o'clock. So meeting with staff members, 13. Okay. So in 40 minutes we have a meeting with staff members. I thought it would be a good idea that um, you go together, three or four, and talk about it, and then give us the results of your discussion, and we talk about it and write it down. Is that okay? This is not very communicative, this uh, no. situation. It's more like in a movie theater <laughs> or in a play. Yeah, we can go to, go to the cafe and rooms. Okay, we? okay. Yeah. yeah. So, so this is what we've written in the application about what the group, the advisory group. That's the start. Yeah. So yeah, yeah. So we have to do that. <laughs> um. Of course. <laughs> At least. Uh, yeah. Exactly. We are talking about who or what is their role or a both. Both. And and what else what else could the group what else could the group contribute to the project? We can have access to the internet. No. No, they're working on it, but Yeah. <laughs> 
there is one more information uh, concerning the advisory group. Um, you know that Strasbourg is one of the project partners and the one who is responsible is, it is not Jean-Claude, but it, his name is Lilian Michaud. Uh, he has been working on employment, uh, this is maybe an employment situation, since, since many years. So they have a lot of information. But the problem is that he does not speak English. Oh. Not a single word. And so um, we decided all together, with Dai and uh, Gillian Kepi, that um, we might have a representative of the advisory group in the project group. And that means that um, uh, the trips, for example, will be paid by the money we have, we might get from, from Brussels. And um, LOD would be the one who would be paid, who is the representative of the advisory group in the project group. Because, because she is able to translate very well from, from French to, uh, to English.
application, we have to have a, you know, we have to have a name. We can't just, you know. So, but yeah, when, once we once we are successful, then you know, there, there is as long as the object as long as the objective is is correct, it could be. Okay. Let, now, um, your task is to find out what the advisory group has to do. Yeah, and maybe you go together, three or four, and uh, you will come back um, ten minutes before one, so you have enough time to discuss it, and then you will give us your results. I don't know how to go about this, though. I don't know what is our task to do, where is the information. But you know what the advisory group is now. Yeah. You know this. And we have now to find out what can the advisory group do in addition to the group members of the project, or maybe in difference. So it is very important, for example, for the dissemination of the project. We are not stuck to five or six uh, project members, but we widen it and suddenly we do have 12 partners. Yeah, this is just one example. But what else can the advisory group do? In addition to dissemination of the, the project results. Do, do people know enough about the project? I just wonder whether the people... Um, I sent to everybody um, a paper which has um, been prepared by Vivian, which is three pages long, and which says more about the project. Yeah, yeah. Remember? Yeah, I remember. Yeah. I have. I have it with me too. Does anybody have an idea? This is European employability of graduates in sport projects. Yeah, yeah, that looks like this. Laura, from you will want to have a trouble. Does anybody have any letters in the memory state? Can we get some copies? I don't have one. Yes. Thank you. 
Advisory means giving advice. So what kind of advances can we give? Please. Okay. Advisory. What kind of advisory? A bit. Important. Support a bit. Promote. Thank you. 